wake up. I can't wait to look at the face you make when you see me. What's wrong? You look like you've seen a ghost. <laughs> oh, listen, listen, listen. You're not going anywhere, honestly. I mean, I am the one who tied you down there. You know, you have a really messy house. A lot of things could get lost here. You know, like jewelry, cell phones, keys to the back door. <laughs> well, you should have told your father to hide them better. But I guess not. Because all he did was hit it under a rug. I guess your dad doesn't really care about you now, does he? <laughs> Who needs parents? Just be a psychopath. Just like me. It's better than just sitting here on your ass all day. Why not go stab somebody? I mean, I've done it a few times. Tonight even, I've done it. It's not that hard. All you gotta do is just jab a knife into somebody's heart and they're dead. Or even, you know, put it to their throats, but... Let's not stop talk- let's- let's not stop talking. Let's stop talking about me. Let's talk about you. <sighs> Let's talk about you. You see... A lot of people don't know a lot of things about you. But I do. Do you remember... Last Halloween. Did you meet someone? Mm hmm. And where did that meeting get you? Exactly. And so, I decided to send them a little visit. You want to know what I did to them? <laughs> you really want to know what I did to him? <sighs> well, first, I gutted him like a pig. And then... I used his blood to write a message on the wall. And the message was, why so scared? You know, I'm taking inspiration from a certain someone around here. Speaking of meeting new people, I've also met a new person recently. Yeah. He was a very, he's a very interesting type of person. He looked very sickly in the eyes. A very pale man, wearing a black hat and suit. He looked quite dapper. But he said he can grant me some great powers if I help him with something. And look what he did to me. The fucker turned me into a demon. <laughs> and now I can do this. 
<laughs> Pretty cool, right? It's helpful around these types of places, you know, undisclosed and, well, somewhat hidden from the public. A real good place to shake somebody. <laughs> Yes, I have special type of powers, and I'm also helping out that guy. He said I'm like something like a, uh... What did he say? What did he say? A lower moon? I don't know what the hell that means, but, uh... I guess I'm one of them now. And I still get to make those nice little phone calls. That everybody also likes. Especially you. Because you got a call from me. That last Halloween. And I asked you. What were you doing that Halloween? You lied to me. You said you weren't doing anything. I saw you at that party. And I know what you did last Halloween. You're not pulling anything. I know exactly who you think you are. And I'm not going to let you figure that out. Because this is going to be where you die. <laughs> I'm sorry, but you're disturbing our peace here. So I'm going to have to eliminate you myself. Sorry, it took me so long to get here. I didn't realize you were in actual danger. No matter. I will take care of this demon myself. Serpent breathing. First form. Winding serpent slash! slash. Are you okay? Are you injured in any way? That's good. Hold still so I can cut you from these ropes. Just to make sure, I'm going to be taking you back to the Hashira, and we will take care of you. Do not worry. Your life is safe in my hands. Can you walk? Good. Then follow me. Let this demon's corpse burn in the sunlight. Let's go. Beep -beep -beep.